It might not be summer, but unfortunately, you can still get a sunburn. 22 News Storm Team meteorologist Kelly Reardon joins us live now to explain snowburn. In the winter, you've got your checklist of a hat, gloves, and scarf, but if you spend long periods of time outside, especially on snow-covered ground, you'll also want to pack your sunscreen. On a bright winter day, the sun's rays not only hit you directly, but they're also reflected off of the snow and back onto your skin, especially your face, which is most exposed. The combination of direct and reflected sun rays can lead to a sunburn if it's not protected with sunscreen. The same science explains why everything seems extra bright on a sunny day when there's snow on the ground. It's amazing how the sun is blinding sometimes in off the snow and make it, the visibility hard to see as you go along every day. You are most at risk for snowburn if you're spending a lot of time outdoors. For example, if you're going for a walk, working, or hitting the slopes. So just because the UV index is not as high as it is in the winter as the summer does not mean your risk for a sunburn is zero. Live in Chicopee, I'm 22 News Storm Team Meteorologist Kelly Reardon.